And this is the legend, Gavin, the proprietor of this fabulous establishment. Okay. Darling, thank you for your hospitality. God, actually, give me a hug. Good on you, sweetie. I'll see thank you again, you though. So you make sure you come back. Thanks for everything. Yeah. yeah. Did your brother get off? Is he on the on the he west went coast? Today, yeah. He went. Mm. Oh, yeah, I might yeah. cross paths with him somewhere down yeah. there. Well, that, yeah. that'd be uh, that'd be there now. Yeah. Low rocky point. They're heading. Yeah. Which is quite a bit. Oh well. Yeah. So we'll see. Maybe. <laughs> Anything's possible on my journey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, darling. You Thank you. The boy's ready to go. <laughs> oh, how exciting. Isn't that the best part of an adventure is like starting a new one, eh? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so where to next? East, west? Uh, west, yeah. West? Up, up to Wynyard, I think. Oh, so we might cross paths up that way. Oh, gee, I hope so. So there's only one day, the Saturday, with the rain, where the lead up, the winds are 30 to 40 kilometres an hour. So that's the only issue for me is the yeah, wind. Yeah, yeah. And it's the southeasterly, so it'll be like, you know, hard, hard going. But, yeah. you know, that's all you got to do is just look at the map. That's it. Look at the weather. Keep an eye on everything. Yeah. And yeah, just and go, go by that. Yeah. So that'll be my down Travel day. Travel safely. Yeah, that's it. And well done, Ozzy. <laughs> it's always an adventure, Darlo. Yeah, it was an absolute pleasure yeah. meeting you, doll. Yeah, thank you, yeah. I'll Enjoy the journey. I'm flown away, let me tell you. Ah. <laughs> yeah, that's no, great. Quite sincerely, I think. Yeah. One of the best parts of being down here, to be honest with you. Oh, don't be silly. Yeah, really. Uh, <laughs> oh, look at those waypoints. Jeez, it's joined the dots. Yeah, pretty Shit. Much. Yeah, I know. Oh, that's, that's enviable. I've <laughs> saturated this area, man. Full on. Especially, nearly got saturated doing that freaking scary gnarly trail yesterday, Ooh, hey? Man, that was that was something oh, else. Let me do tell you. Do you remember the name of that trail? So, what was it in between? It's called Tattersall Tattersall Road, the the bottom end up to the top, and oh, uh, Ken's Lake or something like that. Okay, from, from the other end. All right, I'll avoid it. <laughs> I mean, look, it's a lot of fun. Yeah, and that's on the right bike, scary, it's a bit sensational. Yeah. Really? And not but, fully loaded. Oh, you would never even attempt it. Yeah. You would not even attempt it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you'd be off the... Oh, crikey. All right. I can't imagine. I'll remember those names. They'll be like names in my nightmare. Yeah. All right, doll. May the force be with you. Okay, see you out there. See you out there. Yeah. Carry on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Keep packing up, keep packing up. I landed on the shores of Taz Saturday morning and today is Wednesday morning. <laughs> but I've had my rear bearings replaced can't get the um, anti-vibration clip, so I'm going to have to wait for that, but just put up with it between now and then. And um, and given that the back bearings, so my original bearings lasted 40,000 kilometres. And then when I was in Brizzy, having the suspension done, I told Wyatt, you know, I've been through heaps of river, up the Cape, lots of Coro, let's just replace the bearings while we're at it. So we did. But those bearings have only lasted 15 caves, 15,000 caves. So the back ones, all the balls in it, half of them were missing. And uh, Zane was mint, as you know, came out, picked up my wheel, replaced the bearings, and I was meant to go on my merry way, but I kind of just had a gut feeling that, well, if the back bearings are gone, you know, the front have to have been in not good condition either. So um, he ordered some, and they just arrived, just got the magic check, so I'm gonna race in there, get them replaced, and then I'll just make my way west. So it's overcast, looks like it's going to rain, but the radar's not showing it. So let's just go. Let's have the best adventure ever. Freaking stoked, so happy, so excited. <laughs> All right, right, back into Devonport. <laughs> he's not a miserable bastard. Look at him, he's waving at everyone. One 
saying, oh, just duck down the corner. All good, it's around the corner, Roz, he says. Anyway, got my waterproof backpack, my new two-man tent, some more dehydrated meals. Fuck, I gotta go. Spending too much money, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Off to the post office, posting more shit back. All right, let's go see how this bite's going. Thank you, really appreciate it. And thanks for all the heads up of the 10 million other places I've got to visit now, because, oh my God, now I've got to be here for another month. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my God, that freaking gold, absolute gold. It's 10 to two now, let's go. See ya. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Tasmania. Breathtaking! adventure bike rider in need and in pain and just you know worse stroke of luck so let's go cheer him up and then I'll just take off again tomorrow you know what it would mean to him 
Apparently the um, paramedics said to um, or the cops said to um, Ray that just in the last few days they've picked up or collected five serious injuries from bike riders on the west coast. And um, you know, it's just a gentle reminder that you know it's dangerous. What we do is dangerous, and you know, I know people are expecting me to do some good, challenging trails and that, but you know what? I'm in for the long haul, not the short term. If I've got to ride this joint like a Nana Nunu and just beautifully explore the place, that's what I'll do. You know, I don't don't have big gonads. Still an amateur in the grand scheme of things. And um, I've got a long journey. This is a journey for me, not a race. Yeah, maybe in another 20 years time with all that experience under my belt, I'll bloody go into Fink. <laughs> Give Toby a run for his money. <laughs> Actually speaking of which, poor bastard, he's got a broken collarbone. So there you go. You know, even happens to the best of them. So I'm mindful that I'm an amateur and um, just a courageous one, but I've still got my wits about me. You know, I think the fact that there's still plenty of times I still get shit scared. I think Mark had more confidence in my skill than I did, but I think it's that fear that I maintain that keeps me safe. You know, like I'll do something courageous if, um, you know, just gut feeling tells me it's all right, and then, and then I take it slow. But um, yeah, if you're gonna do shit like that, do it when you've got a buddy. But um, yeah, stuff like this happens, like what's happened to Ray, so let's go cheer him up. You know, it's a pain in the ass putting this shit on and taking it off if when you stop as many times as I do. But end of the day, this is what keeps my legs moving, you know. I can walk, walk away from my bike on my legs. That's the most important thing. All right. We're coming, Ray. We're coming. Preston Falls, I'll come back for you. We gotta go see Ray. We gotta go cheer our buddy up. There's Bernie. Right, just keep working my way across. Let's go. It's five o'clock.
So he's gone for a CT scan and I got a text from him, still smiling. Um, they're gonna plate it tomorrow, operate tomorrow and put a plate in it. And if all goes well, he'll be discharged. God, that sun's bright. He'll be discharged on Friday. So I'm gonna go find somewhere around here, a caravan park or something, and uh, at least check in and come back in an hour and surprise the little critter. Okay, let's go. Oh, Cadbury factory! There's a Cadbury factory! Oh my God. Oh my God. Cadbury factory, go bigger. Oh, number one fan right here. Amazing the people you meet. So Peter, who runs this show, was originally from WA, and he was a draftsman for the um, city of Perth, and designed all the bloody Murray Street Mall and all the roundabouts and slow points all through my place, Big Park, and yeah, went off and travelled the world, and came back, and then went to the Northern Territory and lived up there, and there he is, freezing cold Tasmania. That's <laughs> a work. Said I can go anywhere. Who said I can go anywhere? Sun setting that way, comes up that way. Are we happy with the little new tent setup? So it's a Spartan. Explore planet Earth. Spartan 2 weighs 2.4 kilos, and that's the most important part. 4,000 mm aqua rated, and it was really quick to set up. So this is the second time something like this has happened to me and I've got to ask you Taswegians. I've asked, everywhere I go, it's a steak sandwich. And I say, um, any chance I can have that in a roll, you know, steak burger? And whoever serving me goes, oh, um, I better go and ask. <laughs> and then comes back and goes, oh yeah, that's okay. And I'm like, <laughs> Majority of Australia with steak burgers, but Tasmania, it's steak sandwiches. <laughs> and they're freaking tasty. They're so tasty. <laughs> Saved it for me. All right. I'll go see him. Get the fuck. I know. I'm what is that? Just a hematoma. Are you shitting me? No, I'm not. Fuck. Yeah, yeah. I was already like gulping at that. Mm. Oh, darling. Mate, what are you doing here? Well, fuck, I knew it would cheer you up. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, got here like right. just, I got here earlier. Yeah, I heard somebody, one of the nurses come and said, oh, there's somebody out there, family man wants to see you. And I said, <laughs> no, my family uh, over in South Australia and also down in Hobart. We're family now, darling. Well, we are, thank you, <laughs> I appreciate it. The bike family. Yeah, yeah. But I did feel a scrape on the concrete. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> that's, uh, that's terrible. But then, that's just shit. That is shit. That's just shit. We were just saying, you know, did this fucking gnarly trail yesterday. Gnarly trail, tell me about it. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And then get taken out on a roundabout by a chick. Like, the injustice it's of it all, yeah, you yeah, just no, can't even brag about that, you know. fairness in the world. I know, it's just fucked. <laughs> People like I shouldn't be subject to that kind of behaviour. I know, like it should be fucking a Steve Irwin Brocky moment, you know. Oh, yeah, like, right. yeah, I was just fucking doing a big warp and it was, there was mud, but that wasn't before the bull dust, yeah, before yeah. the gnarly hill climb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm injured because I was going going full gas, going ho. <laughs> so I got nobody to blame but myself. Instead, no, I'm here because of some other fuck. So what did you say? The paramedics said they've done like five pickups from the west coast. Yeah, he said to me, "Where were you going?" And I said, "Well, I was on the way to the west coast." Yeah. He said, "Oh, right, eh?" And he, we got to here by then. Yeah. And he said, "Oh shit!" He said, "Well, look, I mean, obviously we can't go now, but 
He said, yeah, we've just we've just had five rescues out of here with motorbikes. Wow. Oh, just, no, he just said five rescues to start with. Yeah. And I said, what? Oh, what? Uh, overall, he said, no, no, that was just the bike. We had cars too. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought, Jesus, how bad And he that? didn't say for what reason? He actually didn't. He didn't elaborate. No. Yeah. So look, I don't know yeah. how, that, how that came to happen with yeah. these people. So. Whether it's greasy roads. But he did say, just... he did say that it, it is a common occurrence. Yeah. yeah. So maybe the roads aren't as well maintained as we are led to believe them, perhaps. Don't or, know. well, you can't believe that you, you can't believe that many and all cars as well could come to grief. There's got to be something going on with that road. Yeah. No, all good, thanks. <laughs> Cheers. Yeah, you sort of. So I don't know, Ros. You know, yeah. Look, I'm hoping that you won't have that experience. Obviously. I'm just going to drive like a nanu nunu. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm, 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 I'm not in the Fink Desert race yeah. out here. Yeah. I'm exploring. Yeah. So if anything feels unsafe, I'm just slowing it down. That's it. That's you know. The way. That's the one. You know the old saying, the bloody story about the the turtle and the hare. I do. I do. That's it. I'm going to be the ninja turtle, mate. Yeah. <laughs> you know, not as slow as a turtle, well, not as fast as a ninja. I'm going to be a little, little I used ninja turtle. to do a lot of mouth on running. And my, my, the common theme in my head was to finish first. First, you've got to finish. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's it. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 To finish first. First, you've got to finish. That's right. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, yeah. bugger, so, yeah. bugger. So we'll find, you know, I guess, I guess you'll, you'll discover yourself what it's yeah. actually not. Ah, poor bugger. You know, and that's a thing that sucks as well, you know. That's six weeks to heal and basically that's Taz weather done for him, you know. Spewing, poor thing. That's just shit. All right, back to the camp and carry on tomorrow. See you in the morning, Ray. Brother, give you some good drugs.